Hey boos and welcome back to another AI tournament. So we got an AI tournament for the team leader, Kid Boo, the monster. So we got Rakum AI versus Gohan AI. So we're still just looking for good AIs, you know, see if there's anyone that's better than Trunks from Melee. Seeing if we can find an AI for spam. Is there any other build that we can really go with Kid Boo? It's, it's pretty much just... I mean, I don't, I don't think we should give Kid Boo a defense build. It doesn't even sound like something we want to give Kid Boo. Akume AI with a throw. Shocker. And of course, Kid Boo's a monster and good at everything that he does. Whether it be B2 melee or whatever, so. Great melee combo. Not a lot of damage, though. High speed clash. Gohan wins. Super Kamehameha connects by Raccoon. For 8k points of damage. It's a combination. Dodged by Raccoon. Still about an even fight, though. It's a combination. Nice combo, Gohan. Or 9k points of damage. Combo. It's a combination again, oh, but Raccoon blocks this time. That was kind of cheap, though, honey. He wasn't even ready. Raccoon with the juggle. Yeah, I'm just trying to think if there's any more builds that we can really go for, for Kid Boo. It's pretty much melee or B2. It's pretty much it. You know, he doesn't... He can't do B1. I don't, I don't think he's really a person that should be on defense ever. Kid Buu is clearly our powerhouse of our team, so why would he be on a defense build? Raccoon going up to max power. Will we see a Planet Burst? Instant Transmission. You don't see that from Kid Buu that often. Sometimes people forget he even has it, because he rarely does it. Grab and throw by Raccoon. It's a combination. Connects. So I'm guessing that someone's going to be a two-parter, because of course there are AIs that we straight up can't test, and four of them that we can't test on Kid Buu, so there's really no point in having a part three. It'll just be two parts. It looks like Raccoon's going to win round one. Yep, Raccoon wins. Alright, try it again. So we're taking a break from Gotenks Buu. Gotenks Buu needs some more work, but... Take a break. Super Kamehameha dies. Oh, oh, that was close, Rakum. I thought you were gonna, you know, taste a little bit, but nope. Uh, Gohan still dodges the Mr. Combination. Wasn't bad though. Pretty good melee combo from Rakum. Mr. Combination kicked out of it by Gohan though. Nope, Gohan behind him. Nope. Goom with the grab. Surprise, surprise. Charging up. But Gohan's right back in his face with another melee. Come, Rakum throws him away again. Super Kamehameha charges it. Connects for almost 8k points of damage. Wasn't sure if that counted while on the ground because he charged it. So I'm guessing that counted on the ground because if, if it was like full on, that would have done a lot more damage. I was fully charged. That was pretty good, Rakum. Gohan still keeping up with the melee combo. Grab and throw by Gohan. Still about even fight. Gohan charging up. Super Kamehameha. Huh? Dodged. Well, not even dodged. Just kind of missed by Gohan. Sleep. He's sleeping. But grabbed right out of it. And Rakum charging up. Super Kamehameha. Huh? Dodged by Gohan. Or completely missed, I can't, I couldn't really tell. It looks like Gohan's putting in that melee game, Super Kamehameha! And Raccoon just eats it. We're going on to round three. So far, not really blown away by either one of them. So far. Super Kamehameha missed by Gohan. That's the, that's the one thing that's good about Kid Buu. He's just good at everything. He's 
it's good at melee. His B2s are good. Ultimate's good. B1s are good. Kipu's awesome. Rikuma's about a bar ahead. That's the last thing that we need to do. I'm gonna be like DMZ. Oh, we got another test for the goddamn booze. Fuck Kid Boo, he doesn't need to get any stronger. <laughs> nah, I'm just kidding. So seriously, he just hates testing for us. I think he hates testing for everybody, but especially he's like, oh, more testing for Kid Boo? Really? A Kid Boo needs to get any stronger. Of course he does. Kid Boo's a monster. Rakume is just kicking that butt this round. Oh. Really, no B2s, mostly just melee. Sleep, he's sleeping. I grabbed him out of it. Rakume just looks like, wait a minute. Grab him out of it again. Super Kamehameha, and connects, and it's over. Rakume wins. Underhandedly, too. Just whip that ass. Alright, so we got a couple more AIs to test for part one, so be right back. Alright, we are back. So we got Majin, I mean Majin Buu, Kid Buu with Cell AI versus, well, I guess technically his name is Majin Buu. Versus uh, Kid Buu with Trunks. So, I haven't seen Cell, but Trunks was, uh, he's been up and down, you know. It's just Trunks was the AI that we went with for the MVP where he got too cocky and got beat by uh, Goten. But it's also the same AI that slapped the living hell out of Evil Buu. So, I guess we'll just have to find out which AI is going to be putting in that work. Super Kamehameha from Trunks. Uh, okay, connects. What's so it kind of eats it, but then he kind of is like right next to it and hits Trunks with it while Trunks is still launching his. Missed the combination from Trunks, dodged. So we're hoping that uh, missed the combination from Cell connects. Hoping that you know Trunks shows how you know impressive he is for melee game wise. Good to have uh, you know all of the AIs on staff. Cell connects for 8k point them. Missed the combination from. Uh, Trunks had a high-speed clash. Trunks wins it and ends it with a super combo they have. Nice, and they got about an even fight still. They're both doing pretty good combos. Mr. Combination connects from Cell. Looks like Cell likes to do Mr. Combination. So we're still looking for a good AI for spam. Mr. Combination Trunks, but is blocked by Cell. Trunks is supposed to be doing them good melee combos, but so far he really hasn't been doing much of anything. You know, I want to see like 14 to 20 hit combos from Trunks. There you go, see, like that. Cell is still in the lead though. And Cell is just all over the place. Classic combo by Cell. It looks like Cell might be taking round one. Unless Trunks sets up his game. Super Kamehameha hot, fully charged! Oh my god, Cell, you ace hat! It's anybody's battle at this point. And it looks like Trunks will be taking it. Good job, Cell, eating that Super Kamehameha hot full charge. You were just looking at it, you are like, oh my god, it's so pretty. Super Common Hell from Trunks. Missed the combination, and Cell eats it. Fully charged again. Cell. Cell. Missed the combination from Trunks. Dodged by Cell. A grab from Cell. Missed the combination from Trunks again. Dodged by Cell, barely. He was like, I'm gonna leave it for fly up. Like, no, no, no. With the combination it's tracking. We got a uh, Super Kamehameha Hawk quick fired into Trunks' face by Cell. Trunks going to max power. And Trunks, despite being in max power, kind of just stops his melee combo. That was a pretty impressive melee combo. Trunks does nothing with his max power. Missed the combination again. Trunks likes missed the combination. I have no problem with him wanting to spam that move. Super common hop from so quick launch, but Trunks dodges. And it looks like Trunks wins it. 
All right, so we got one more, uh, well, one more test fight between two more AIs for this first part. So I'll go ahead and get them. Be right back. All right, back again. So we got Krillin AI versus Vegeta AI. Oh, well, I mean, if Vegeta AI wants to throw a whole bunch of B2s, that'd be great. And we could probably look to him for maybe uh, being our spam builder. But fucking Trunks throwing all the mystic combinations. You know. I just don't know. This characters are weird. Krillin and I starting off a pretty good melee combo. Uh, Vegeta AI yeah, has been pretty much just getting slapped around. Super Kamehameha! Huh? Dodged by Vegeta. Vegeta going up the max power, or will we see a planet burst? Krillin AI going up the max power? Nope, Super Kamehameha! Huh? Dodged by Vegeta again. A whole bunch of rush blasts from far distance from Vegeta. It's not a surprise though. And we see a little bit of juggling. Mystic combination from Vegeta connects. For 12k points of damage combo. Nice. Almost 13k actually. Mystic combination. Connects. That long grab. If it was a normal grab, he might have grabbed him. But that long grab went right past him. Connects for 8k points of damage. I don't know what the hell just happened, all of a sudden, Krillin was just getting his butt kicked by Vegeta again. Well, Vegeta tried to jump back and do something, but Krillin didn't let him. Krillin with a pretty good melee combo. Krillin missed a combination, blocked by Vegeta. Super Kamehameha Hell right in Krillin's face for almost 8k points of damage. And it looks like Vegeta might be taking this. Yep, Vegeta wins. Alright, round two. Just find the round, Krillin. Vegeta with a pretty good melee combo with the throw. Vegeta is pretty much dominating Krillin again. The whole bar ahead already. Grab from Krillin. Grab from Vegeta. Just keep going after each other. A couple of dodges. High speed clash. Vegeta wins it. Vegeta is just dominating Krillin. Neither of them have the energy to be doing much of anything right now, so. Both of them charging now, that's good. It's a combination from Vegeta, blocked by Krillin. Charged up just enough energy just to block that hit. Dodge from Krillin. Or Rush Blast from Vegeta. Now they're just synchronized dancing now. Grab from Vegeta. Sleep. Is he gonna get it off? Yep, because that's totally what Vegeta needed was more health. This is a combination from Vegeta. Doesn't make it. Doesn't make it. Krillin outruns the Mr. Combination. Mr. Combination does not connect because Krillin's on the ground. Throw by Krillin. Krillin, scoop it up. It's over, Krillin. Like, not only was he dominating you already, but then he allowed him to get the sleep off as well. He didn't even need it. He was just rubbing in your face. Super common health and Krillin misses. Or is dodged. I, I can't tell. One of the two. It didn't connect. Krillin charging. Vegeta charging. Krillin going up to max power. Will we see a planet burst? Vegeta going up to max power. Will we see a planet burst? It's the combination. Once again, that stretchy grab misses, so... Krillin connects. 9.6k points of damage. Krillin tries to get off sleep. Planet burst from Vegeta, and it's over. 
GG, Krillin. GG. Alright, well, that was part one of Kid Boo AI... Multi, mul multiple AI tests. So, I hope this was useful. And I'm uh, ready to go ahead and do part two with uh, six more AIs, and then we can't do the last four because they're all like B1s and Majin Buu can't have them, of course. So, thank you for watching. Thank you for supporting me as your tester, and I'm looking forward to some more test requests. Thanks for watching.